start for uh, Bomadevara. Kim Mujin took a little bit too long in his first ah. uh, bit there. Sporting a very colourful bandana, Kim Mujin. Damn. He's just clipped the lock straight away in the second set. Nine. Uh, we know that India has had a, a lot of Nine. Korean influence, though. The Ten. Ten. Great, great stuff. Nine. Nine leaves the door open here. Jesus Flores, Korea versus Mexico in quarterfinal number one on Recurve Sunday in the men's competition. Yes. So three hours per set. The scores of those three hours are added up. Whoever gets yes. the top score and all the matches we're going to see for the rest of this session is six points. Yes. And yes. Kim yes. Wujin starts off. Uh, sometimes that nervousness just changes the pressure slightly and he seems to have found the gold now. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Second arrow in the venue is going to be marked. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> right. Yes. Yes. One arrow here to finish this in three sets. Needs a ten. Wujin <laughs> <laughs> starts with uh, being told by his coach to calm down. Yes. Ooh, a yellow bird flew right in front of him just before that. I don't know if he saw it, whether that put him off at all. No idea. But yes. Yes. Marked for a measure from Kim Woo Jin. So perhaps it's not all lost. Yes. That's clearly out, I think. Following the 26 in his first set. Kim Woo Jin needs a 10 here. Yes. Gets it for a 20. A ten? I, th I think it looked like a ten. Yes. Super opportunity for Kim Woo Jin. He knows it. Yes. yes and yes. If he's going to do that, he's going to have to shoot nearly all tens. There's no other way. Yes. It's hard. It's so hard. You think, well, that's it now. Kim Regin's just going to finish this one off. Yes. 70 minutes. Yes, yes. And just yes. about hits the other in the, the gold medal match of the World Cup. Yep, and that day it was Lee Wu Suk who made it through. To defend the title he won last year in Rome, can he do it again in Samson? Yes. Oh, it's absolutely. out who is going to be the champion of Guangzhou. Kim Wu Jin takes on Li Wu Xiok and it's Kim to shoot first. 
Opening arrows are outside the nines and tens throughout the match. Nine to win. Ten and that ten remains ten the same ten with ten one ten arrow ten that's ten tickling ten the spot. And as you in an individual match three times before, um, and it's also for well similar reasons very difficult to predict predict who will win. When you are going to shoot, and it looks so different to Kim Woo Jin's approach, which is very steady. Uh, shooting a kid's bow, it looks so easy. Um, but I can assure you, if you pull back his bow, it's also going to be very heavy, especially for somebody who hasn't. Uh, On fire here, matching Kim Woo Jin. Nine, Nine open. <laughs> Simple answer: Yes, the arrows will typically fly faster. Four two for Maron Espoli, Kim Woo Jin. And a spot of bother here. Yeah, the experience uh, certainly, but Maron Espley shooting incredibly well at the moment. Is that nine though, the opportunity Kim was looking nine. for? No. No. He has a lot of nines that are just out, but the difference could have been even greater in this match. Back into the... Shoot in the very important ten to clinch the set, but in the three sets after, when he needed a ten, he shot a nine. So um, he is feeling the pressure. Korean, not quite up to his very best, but a ten, and he's through to the gold medal match. Nine, nine leaves the door open. Jay Diok, six five and a shoot off ten nine. So hard a draw there for Kim, but he's beaten both of his compatriots in the quarters and the semis to come through to the final against Tang, who's a fine archer. Led a World Archery Youth champ uh, World Archery Championships just yet. Been a four now. 29 to 28, Tang leads two set points to nil. given his opponent the advantage here in the second set. So Kim with a two-point lead with one arrow left in the second set. A nine or a ten will win it. And yes, he's uh, taken contingent. Check that out. This is uh, cool to see. So I'm getting all the support take down one of the sport's true heavyweights. Yeah. Yeah. Kim keeps scoring like that. Kim has four tens in the match, Tang three now. Yeah. So Kim has a chance here to win the third set. Yeah. And he takes it. Set. Scored 29 in the third set, but lost the set. Yeah. And Kim's just to believe it in a tongue could score another 29 here and lose the match. Yeah. I loved it for the gold medal. Yeah. He does it again. Kim, what a performance from him. Eight tens in a row to end the match. Just breathtaking quality. Doesn't get any better than that. He fired or shot 12 arrows in that match.